First and foremost, I want to apologize to you for bringing you here. I truly hope that you understand that I did not bring you here to embarrass you. I did not bring you here to break up with you. I brought us here because I wanted us to grow. And I wanted me to become the person that you need me to be and vice versa. And I feel, I can't tell you how much I've grown. You just saw me cry. And throughout the things that happened through the course of my experience, I've cried, I felt every single emotion that a human can feel. And you know how uncomfortable that is for me to express and to be an open person. Most importantly, like I've taken this time to really self-reflect and, and the things that you had to witness week after week with Bonfire, like there's some of those things that I truly, truly regret. And those were just things that were emotionless and I apologize for those. And I know you and I know how much that hurt you. <laughs> I know my feelings don't really matter right now, but just know that I felt terrible about that. And I'm truly sorry. Let me just clear the air. I don't know what you saw or what you didn't see at the bonfire, but I'll just be completely honest and own exactly anything and everything that I've done here. Um, at the beginning, I received lap dances from girls. I don't know if you saw that. Um, you know, we had a party that we called the blackout party. Everyone, including myself, we got extremely intoxicated. And I took a shower with this girl, Samantha. And after the shower, this other girl, Peyton, came into my room and we started making out in my bed and my relationship with Peyton was strictly on a friend level. Am I allowed to cut you off? You guys can talk. This I mean, is, yes. you're, you're digging yourself a hole right now. I'm not and trying to dig a hole. I I'm mean, trying to do Peyton, a hole. Peyton, this one, and then now you have feelings and you're falling in love with Tanita. Like, so I'm, so I'm so trying to clear the air. So some girl sees you in that behavior and yes. then falls for you? So That's let me just really clear the sad. air. I'm trying to clear the air and be open and honest with you of what happened, because I don't know what you saw or didn't see. So again, I kissed Mel. I mean, just like, like, you don't have to tell all of America that you just whored yourself out.